Good evening, everyone. Iran's nationwide uprising marked its 170th day on Saturday as parents and locals gathered outside the regime's education department in various districts of Tehran and other cities, protesting poisonous gas attacks targeting their children and warning regime officials that their children are their red lines. There are numerous reports of the latest string of gas attacks targeting schoolgirls in different cities across Iran. Dozens of schoolgirls fell ill after poisonous gas attacks targeted the all-girls smart school in Malard, Sayyid Jamaluddin Asadabadi school in Tehran's Abdul Abad district, Tawhid school in Shahriyar, M Emalat. Al-Qadir and Bahar, Bagar al-Ulum, Umm Abiha, and Asadian schools in Islam Shah and Parand in Tehran province. People rallied outside Tehran's district's five education department protesting the recent gas attack. Our enemy is right here. They lie saying it's America and incompetent officials shame on you, they chanted. They also gathered outside Tehran's District 7 Education Department and Tehran's District 2 Education Department, chanting, we don't want competent officials. People in Tehran protested the gas attacks, Basij and IRGC URR ISIS, and we don't want a child-killing regime, they chanted. Parents of school kids gathered outside Ardebil's education department in northwest Iran, where gas attacks targeted at least seven all-girls schools and left more than 400 schoolgirls ill. Parents in Isfahan, central Iran, rallied outside the city's education department. Acid attacks and poisoning are both crimes, secure schools is our right, and we don't want incompetent officials. They chanted. The all-girls Masumer school in Tabriz, an all-girls school in Hamadan, and an all-girls Valley Asa school in Zanjan, all in northwest Iran, three all-girls schools in the city of Rash, and one in Lahijan, northern Iran, and Ketabchi school in the city of Kashan were targeted of poisonous attacks as well. Regimes playing close agents in Kermanshah, western Iran, attack parents concerned about their children following the recent poisonous gas attacks targeting the schools. Thank you very much for joining us.